Hello everyone, Drudge here with an episode of Dark Souls 3. Um, kind of anxious to show you this one because I've actually accomplished a lot. I did get done with the Great Wood Tree. Um, as you can see, my gear is actually a little bit. I actually went to the top. I have the Firekeeper Rogue, the Morn's Helm, Lothric Knight Gauntlets, and the Firekeeper Skirt. I have a few more rings now. I have better weapons. Uh, I don't quite have enough dexterity to properly use that, so I'm going to have that as my third weapon. But, I found out my main hand weapon is really powerful. And I found out how to properly use my staff. And that is why I use it as my offhand weapon. Dummy me always just wanted to use it as my main hand. But uh, in this episode, I want to go into the grave that is here and explore that. Area. Now, I was in it a little bit, but not too much. And now to get the helmet I have, I actually had to kill off an NPC, and I don't know if it was a bad idea or not. However, the weapon I have is actually quite good. Now this attack, this spell, is really powerful and really cool looking. But it's only really useful if you can see an enemy approach and you have time to actually get it started. So if you don't know how an enemy attacks, it might not be a good idea to use it. Like I said, I did get a little bit into this area. This is the grave. Um, it's kind of interesting because you have to be careful because there is skeletons. Ah, right here's one actually. Fortunately for me, my main hand weapon is a fist weapon. So it's actually quite fast and it packs a punch. <laughs> I didn't. Oh my gosh! I asked for that one. <laughs> Just hang my head in shame. I've been through that area like a lot, and I never had that issue. <laughs> But I kind of made that mistake. So, yeah. Oh, it won't be too hard for me to get back in there and get my souls back. Because uh, now that this door's unlocked, all I have to do is just target. I kind of like the robes I have because it kind of makes my guy look like a badass. But eventually, I'm going to be getting. Uh, more armor. Because uh, I did... I looked into the game more and more to see how it actually works. And I was like really far off on what I should and should not be having. So since the rats kind of attack a little bit slowly... You know, you, you kind of don't need to worry too much about them. They don't do much damage. Uh, my Estus Flask is actually improved, so I get more heals. So I'm not too worried about that. Certain items I do need to remove from this hot bar, if you will. But... Overall, it's pretty good. I am rather actually enjoying my character now more and more. Remember that douchebag. There we go. Alright, took care of all that. Got my lost souls back. Uh, it's been a few days since I played, so I'm probably a bit rusty. Alright, you're triggered. Kill him quick. Okay, just him. 
Kill him quick. I love this main hand weapon I have. And as you've seen, it is really powerful. And then with the magic offhand abilities, it's kind of a good combo, if you ask me. Alright, it looks like there's nothing up there. Now, see, I didn't go the whole way back in this cave. I don't think. Maybe I did. I'm not sure. Oh, you know what? Yes, I did. Uh, but this is how you get down to the cavern. Uh, do be careful because there is guys up there and they will drop down. Uh, but I already got the items that way. That's the way you want to go to get the items that are down in the ravine. Uh, ah, I never noticed him before. I didn't hit him. I think I grazed it and that was it. There we go. That's what's nice about magic abilities. Less red and white shield, plus one. Let's see what that looks like. Probably won't actually use it. That's actually kind of cool. There is an ability to it, but it doesn't too much of well, do much of what I'm actually looking to have done. Uh, so yeah. Now there is rats or rat right here. But more, even more, it will come out of this wall here. And that, my friends, is why I love this fist weapon. <laughs> you can just go to town and just destroy everything. Right, a little magic. So, you look that a little bit. Yeah, I remember I did come up this way because uh, I actually got her, so she's taken care of now. Uh, and if you remember, this is actually right near the Great Wood Tree. And uh, this guy here, Morn, I killed him. <laughs> Automatically, you get his uh, two-handed mace and his shield. Oh, this isn't Great Wood. This is the guy that sucks. This is where I have to go, but this guy sucks. Like, I am... <clears throat> I seriously don't know how to fight this guy that well. Um, I'm trying... I want to try to lure him. To the point of where I can attack him at a range. But I don't know if that is completely possible. This guy sucks to fight. Like, if there's a way I can attack him through the wall, I kind of trick him. Okay, now I'm just going to run up here. Because he leaps far. Far, and he does a lot of damage. Very easily. Yoo-hoo! I'm right here. I know you want me. He's toying with me right now. Yep, he's toying with me. Where'd he go? Oh, that's not cool. Where'd you go, dude? Oh, he's back at his... Spot. This guy is like insanely hard to fight. He's fast and he's powerful. 
There he goes. See, he does a lot of frost attacks, and he can really lunge, and he has a lot of speed. Thing, uh, a lot of us uh, RuneScape players do is try to find the spot, the safe spot. Which I can stand up here and let him wail away like that until he gets tired of it, tries to turn around. <laughs> yeah! Alright, let's see what that is. I know that was a very cheatsy way of doing it, but I don't care. <laughs> Alright, it is... Okay, look. Oh, okay, there, there's how you can see some effects. Yeah, I still don't get what's so special about that shield. <clears throat> it has that, but I don't know what that is. Like, that is fire. That, I don't know. So, I'm assuming it's good, but yeah. Uh, where is that sword at again? Oh, right here. It has a lot of stuff to it. There's additional effects of, I believe, probably frost. But, I think that's about it. And right now, I kind of like my... Actually, I have an idea. Okay, it's a two-handed weapon, but I want to see what it looks like. Oh, that is cool. So, I have a two-handed weapon that is frost. I think I might actually keep that. Because, uh, dun dun dun! This sword is actually fire. Stop doing that. There we go. And then this one is actually I believe, dark. Oh, I, just, I can't believe I actually got him finally. Because <coughs> I actually did try him a few times and I failed miserably. See, to me, he was as hard as some bosses can be. Please be a bonfire right here. Yes! Ha 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 ha. Let's rest up. Let's leave that. Does he appear back in there? No, nah, so he's he is like a mini boss, basically. Because once he's dead, he's dead. Alright. I made progress on camera. That is a f whoa. Hello. Huh. You're actually kind of strong. Whee! A tropic punch. 
Shriving stone. That's got to be a good item. I think that's how you get the holy weapons. Okay. I see stuff up there. Well, he looks weird. He looks angry, too. <clears throat> weird and angry. Uh, but then again, what kind of creatures in here don't look weird? Whee! Sorry, bud, you just made that way too easy. Alright. There's nothing over there. I'm so happy right now, because I actually made progress on camera for a change. Before they notice me... Funny at all. Okay, let's see if I can't do this. And that is why having magic spells is awesome. I took him out from a safe distance, risking absolutely nothing but the sanity of missing the shot. Okay, item. A new traveler, so I will rather enjoy that. Okay, so there is a way over there. I'm guessing maybe this way? <clears throat> no, that's not it. Doesn't look like it's above me. Uh, do I have to actually drop off over here? I guess I do. Didn't look safe at first, but eh. <coughs> that's the only way to do it. That's the only way to do it. Great him. Ho 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 ho! You, my friend. Butcher knife. I really should pay more attention to my surroundings. Brigand armor. This game is like notoriously known for having like. Oh, you might as well say jump scares. Brigand twin daggers. Okay, well, since I have new gear, let's check it out. I have a feeling that's a very fast weapon. Alright, since that's going to be my two-hand weapon. Yeah, see, this is fire, ice, and then dark. I want to... Oh, I don't have enough dexterity again. But I want to at least see what it looks like. I like that, that looks cool. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, <clears throat> hey, well before I go any further, I want to get my... Uh, shimmer, yeah. My katana. Back up. And also... There we go. 
So you can see the benefit of having magic. Magic abilities are quite beastly in this game. This way. See, there's another guy up there. Can I get close enough to attack him? Oh, I can get close enough to attack him. too close for comfort. Titanite shard. That's going to be useful. Oh, that's how you get up here. Okay, I see. Da, 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 da. I think this is the longest I went in a new area without actually dying. So, I'm quite happy with myself. There is one area in in previous... Oh. I see you now. Let's see if I can't shoot you from here. Ah, he's dead. Okay, there's one more up there, it looks like. more down there. What are you doing? You need to die. Ear holes. Whoosh. I guess I shouldn't have been bragging about how good I've been doing. <sighs> well, those guys to fight are pretty intense. There's one of them. Remember, they can fly. To what degree they can fly, I have no idea. And here we go. The camera decided it was going to change on me. Okay, there's one. If I can get them one at a time, it won't be nearly as bad yet. Your buddy literally just killed himself. I didn't think I'd take care of those two so efficiently, actually. Well, since I'm out of magic, it's just like, why not just use, you know, a better weapon? So I actually can use that efficiently. Actually, no, I can't because I don't have enough uh, strength. I need a little bit more strength. So you're still alive. That is so loud. Good riddance. Jeez. Ember, I need those because I. I don't know how to get that back without using that item. Since I don't know when there's another bonfire and I don't know what's going to be through here. Okay, it looks like there's nothing right there. And right there's another bonfire. I'll actually call it an episode on this bonfire. Uh, there's a few items I want to get back at, uh, and probably level up a little bit. That's about it. 
So, uh, yeah, let's get this bonfire. We'll see what these guys want, and then maybe I'll phone them soon. Hi. Oh, hello. I am Anri of Astora. Unkindled. This is Horace, a friend and traveler. Are you too in search of the Lords of Cinder? We are well along the road of sacrifice. Beyond the flooded woods lies Farron Keep, home of the undead legion. Further yet is the cathedral. We seek the cathedral, home of the grim old. We may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of lords. The next time we cross paths, one may find the other in a time of need. May the flames guide your way. Okay, she was nice. Oh, yes, he's not very tall, but don't think he'll live without his. Okay. We are well along the road of beyond the flood. You may go the ah. next minute. Maybe she would say Sorry. something different. <laughs> Blue Sentinels. Gaha. Gaha. <laughs> All right. Uh, Way of Blue. Pledge oneself to the Way of the Blue Covenant. Pledge oneself to the Blue Sentinels of the Covenant. I will take Blue Sentinels. That sounds useful. For what I'm not sure, but it sounds useful. Alright, so I'll go head back to the base. Well, uh, yeah, the shrine, but I'm gonna see if I can, uh. Get something a little bit more going for you guys. Because I do want to get my armor, but there's an armor piece I particularly want to get. Oh, I got the. Red Eye Orb, too, so now I can invade other worlds at will. But, <clears throat> since my graphics card isn't where it needs to be for this game, or most games, it, uh, I can't quite do it. Alright, so I did find, what? Uh, Pickle Pea, yeah, I did find Pickle Pea. I got all the items near there. Um,. Yeah, so I did actually get kind of far. I kind of did my normal thing again, though, of killing an NPC that I may or may not should have. Uh, it was the guy that was actually up there, but I got hit the cracked red eye orb. Well, not the cracked, but the red eye orb. So. Hmm. I am Sirius of the Sunless Realms, former servant of the Divinity. Duties we each bear. But one's duty is a sol- I doubt we've much to gain. Blessing of the moon upon your journey. I doubt we've much to gain from fraternization. Blessing of the moon upon- Okay, so what, you don't like me? Well then. Ooh, yes, I wanted to get my body armor. Because it's time I actually start focusing on my defense. Ah, well, how may- Purchase item. Yeah, see, I got both of those keys, and there's this one area I want to get to, because I see there's, like, a somebody locked behind it. I don't know if it's a boss or what, or a helpful NPC, but I can't get them. And I would really like to get them. Uh, yeah, Leonard. I killed Leonard, yeah. Uh, I don't know if that was a good idea or a bad idea. I already got the eye orb, so... I don't know. Ashen one. Be sure to bring more souls. <laughs> All right, let's get this armor, and I'll show you guys. Okay, see, I'm soon at my max, but that armor looks sick, and that setup is just actually kind of cool. So I always kind of like the. I think it was ever since like I played some of the Final Fantasy games where like lancers and knights would have like the plate body but they had a cloth, cloth skirt and to me it just it looks really cool oh how may I uh, that's like the main piece of armor I want to get there is a few other pieces I do want to get but I, just, I don't know yeah, there's that striving stone undo weapon and fusion well, that doesn't sound that great uh, I don't really need the soul arrow anymore uh, there's actually a different spell I want to get. I know I sell most of my weapons, but that's because there's only certain ones I want to use pretty much. So, I keep them. 
Okay, I'm only going to get 70, so I'm going to keep that for now. Yeah, there's a silver mask. That's what you get from uh, Leonard. To me, it looks kind of neat. I I like the way it looks. Firekeeper robe. That was a pain in the butt to get, but I don't want it. Yeah, get rid of that. Yeah, get rid of that, because I want to get... Uh, I like the robes for that. Okay. You see, here's the thing. I'm not sure what to do. <laughs> I have these four equipped that boost my sorceries. I'll probably end up getting rid of that eventually. And just going with a different ring. But even even this one, to me, is not worth it. But the Espis, the Estus ring, not Epstis. Uh, that ring is actually kind of useful. It's just, I guess once I start getting more and more souls, I guess maybe it won't be as much of a big deal. But, also, if you guys know, oh, here's another weapon I can sell. Uh, I want to keep that one because I kind of like it the way it looks. But, if you guys know of a way where I can actually get more items and just like, one. I think it was a... Uh, Maybe it was a tight night shirt. I'm not sure what it was, but from Pickle P. I was only able to get one item from her. Ah, which is good. This what needs. And I'm not sure if I missed something or what. Reinforce a weapon. Now. I kind of want to reinforce something. Yeah, I want to save that twinkling one for later. Yeah, see, there are certain items I want to use eventually, but... I don't know what Moan does for that weapon. Okay, that one supports that, but what is that? Driving stone. Okay. What tribute is it adding? Nothing. It's adding no attributes. And it would take away my fire damage. So, that's not worth it. And that one can't even have it. Oh, it takes away the element, so it's taking away that, but it boosts up the additional effects. I see. So it's actually not useful at all. That looks like that makes that worse. That actually makes that better. That uh, makes that worse. Except for it provides a better defense, but... Well, not really, because the guard absorption is better. It's just the physical attack power goes up. But when it comes to the shield, don't you kind of want it to be super defensive? I don't want to... <clears throat> I don't want to beef that weapon up yet, because I don't know what I'm going to end up using. So, yeah, we'll just, we'll, we'll let that go at that. Okay, be careful. Be quiet. Rawr. I do like the effect that sword has, that the ice just flying off of it like that. Alright, we'll talk to you, we'll level up. Welcome uh, home. Okay. Speak. Yeah, I, I don't know what the dark sigil does, but that is a lot of Very souls well. to heal it. Then touch the take nourish. Okay, so I can get one level up. Um, I wanted to get what dexterity. Ah, I don't remember. Let's get out of there. Farewell, Ashen One. May the flames guide thee. Oh, you can kill her as often as you like, but you don't get anything for it. I think. 
Okay, so properly to use that, I need actually two, and for that I need one strength. One strength to properly use this. See, that causes bleed, and that causes frostbite. Ah, that's what that is, frostbite. Well, since Welcome I can home, properly use that. this blade, let's just uh, use this one. Very well. Then touch the cake nourish. Okay. And that'll help me overall with damage and everything, so. Okay, make sure to select strength. I can now well, properly use one. my sword. I do like that stance, it is pretty cool. Especially with this kind of a mask and armor. Kind of makes him look kind of sick. That is a powerful attack, and it does use a little bit of magic. That's kind of why I wanted to use um, a sorcerer to start with, because you're going to have more magic to start, and It'll help you in the long run. I kind of want to kill her, but I don't want to kill her, so I'm not going to. Um, but, oh, yeah, before I forget. Okay, so I need two dexterity for this. But this weapon, it is the ba -ba 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 dark hand. It has, it'd be better suited for guard because it's special if it's in your defensive hand. Yeah, it kind of like grabs a hold of him, does a lot of damage, but it takes a while to launch. Speak, thy honorable lord. Okay, but yeah, I actually got it from her. Uh, yeah, see right here. Now the other thing is like um, <laughs> these rings. Uh, that one would be actually very useful. Actually, somebody like me would actually kind of benefit from that. But I'm thinking about maybe getting this spill. Ah, uh, yes, spill. Uh, but see, I don't really use shields, so that's not a big deal. But I kind of want to actually get this one next, the sorcery. Uh, it reinforces your weapon with magic, so I, don't, I think that would be pretty good. Um... I don't want to undo the hollowing, I don't know why, but it's just, it's really high, and I don't know if that's good. Till we meet again. Unfortunately, this dude died. Uh, I did not kill him. <laughs> I can say I didn't kill him. But my guy is getting pretty strong, I think anyway. Oh, uh, but... That'll do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I know I'm actually having a very good time playing this game, even though it is hard to play, but it is good. But I think my character is actually starting to look kind of like a badass, like I would like. So... Ah, it is good to what needs. Too bad you can't, like, reinforce it. Pretty armor. be careful. I don't want to see my work squandered. Although I have a feeling this armor is actually some of the best armor you I, I don't know why I think that, but it's just, it's just like, look at the durability and the resistances it has. And not only the resistance, but the physical absorption. It's gotta be good. Uh, up next, I do want to replace the Lothric. I probably will replace the Firekeeper's uh, skirt in time. It's just, right now, my equip load is kind of getting kind of high, so I don't want to do that. But ah, let's ha. see how much weight that adds. Yeah, see, those gauntlets are way better. But in time, I do want to get that, but it is a lot heavier, so I kind of can't do that yet. Uh, there is other sorceries I want to get. Ashen one, um, be sure. 
There's a spell that Leonard guy used that I really kind of want. Uh, I can get some more... I can get cleric spells, but... I don't think they'd be very useful. For me. I mean, I did unlock more, so... Oh, champion, do you wish to hit? Yes, learn miracles. Okay, yeah, so if you go into there... Go to her and learn miracles. This is the lady that you say that's near Morn. If you go the back way with the rats, you can reinforce your weapons <laughs> or prevent spells being cast and trans, like making traps and whatnot. I wonder if that gets like within a certain vicinity or if it doesn't do much. See, like this is why magic is kind of nice. Because you can use something like that, and then you would never have to worry about, you know, having to go back. And right there, like, right there's a way to restore health. Have a pleasant journey. Change there is one more thing I do want to show you, now I think about it before I forget. Uh, there's what is called the Twisted Soul Lords. Um, they drop very unique souls. Uh, it'll actually be their souls, like the great, uh, the great wood. Um, I actually recommend you keep a hold of those souls until you unlock this shop up here, because this guy up here. Aha, that so. Yeah, he wants your twisted souls, and you get a transportation kill on after you beat the rotten great wood. But see, there's different weapons, and all those require different souls. See, there's a soul of a demon, um, and see, some of them, you can, there's two different weapons that you can get, but you can only get one or the other. And right now, I would have loved to have been able to get this. But I don't have a soul of a demon. Maybe I didn't find it yet. Actually fight the demon yet. But I do want to get that weapon. But more importantly, I want this ring. But I don't think there's any way to get uh, another soul of Boreal Valley Vort. I, I don't think there is, and I already consumed it. So I kind of screwed myself on that one. Now, so if now. you do play, do not keep in be mind... Away. Overlong. That they actually do have some shops that appear up here. Uh, don't just, you know, use your items willy nilly. Actually, think about it. That's what I like about this game. There's a lot of cause and effect. But um, thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Dark Souls. Until next time, later, guys.